cameraman's given us clearance, so we'd like to go ahead and get started tonight. A meeting we've all been looking forward to for a while. I'd like to call to order this special meeting of District 116 for May the 19th, 2019. Roll call, please. Member Carter. Here. Member Exum. Here. Member Patton. Here. Member Pulaski. Here. Member Fisher is here. Vice President Hall. Here. And President Demet. Here. Quorum is present. A uh, motion to approve this evening's single item agenda would be in order. So moved. moved. Seconded. <laughs> moved and seconded. All in favor say aye. 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 Those opposed, same sign. Motion is carried. Uh, citizen statements. We do have one this evening. Uh, Scott, uh, make sure the light is green. Good evening. Uh, Good evening. Oh, back off a little bit. <laughs> Um, I just wanted to uh, briefly say a few things. First of all, I wanted to say thank you to Dr. Williams and his staff for the job they did in the interim, uh, bridging the gap. It's a good, good applause, but he's not done yet. So. That's right. <laughs> Um, also, I would like to thank the members of the board uh, for the process that has been put in place for the search. Um, I know, you know, it was, there was probably a little bit more of a crunch on the timetable that you would, than you would have liked, uh, but having the opportunity to serve on the community interview board, uh, the three candidates that we had the opportunity to speak with were all very qualified, uh, and I believe that uh, even with that shortened time frame, uh, the exec search committee was able to return some very qualified candidates, so uh, I was happy to have the opportunity to be part of that. Uh, and lastly, I just want to say that I'm thankful that we're coming to the end of everything and that we're able to move forward and that our parents group is looking forward to working with the new superintendent to hopefully keep uh, moving, moving the needle forward. So that's all I have. Thank you Thank very you. much. Thank, Thank you. you. Anyone else wish to address the board this evening? Seeing none, we'd uh, like to move into our action item this evening, which is the employment of a new superintendent. I'd like to begin by um, saying that uh, we began this process with obtaining the services of Exec Connect to make sure that we had conducted a national search. Um, and they indeed brought outstanding candidates to us. Uh, and the best was found in our own backyard. Surviving such a competitive search instills confidence that the best possible candidate will be before us tonight. The board's interest is to restore relationships, to strengthen our ethos of collaboration, to regain leadership in academics, and to bring best ideas and practices from not just our system or our state, but from across the nation. No one can restore relationships or regain academic leadership faster than Jennifer. The board is interested in ideas from outside uh, the community, the best practices from outside the community, and for our district, we have the confidence that Jennifer indeed shares that vision and will uh, have the confidence that it takes to make it happen and to infuse the district with ideas from across the country. We worked with Jennifer on ways to not just measure ourselves against past descriptions of excellence, but to challenge our definitions of innovation and success by measuring ourselves, indeed, all from school districts all across the country. And to those discussions were indeed fruitful, productive, and inspiring, leading to a real sense of excitement, anticipation, and confidence. As we now take this next step forward in the life of District 116 in Urbana, the board looks forward to working with our community, our students, staff, administration, and Jennifer to talk about academics, restorative justice, school safety, school improvement, student voice, and indeed student greatness. Most definitely, we really look forward to trusting relationships that build teamwork and collaboration throughout the district and the whole community. It starts with a warm greeting from this entire board to our new superintendent, Dr. Ivory Tatum. Therefore, I would ask for a motion motion to employ Dr. Jennifer Ivory Tatum as Urbana School District 116's next superintendent of schools and to approve a five-year employment agreement thereby establishing her starting salary at $205,000 annually with subsequent increases commensurate with the board negotiated raises of other certified staff of the district 
The contract provides that Dr. Ivory Tatum will be responsible for paying her own teacher's retirement sister contributions and will receive family health insurance as with past superintendents of the district. The contract allows Dr. Ivory Tatum 25 vacation days, 15 sick leave days, and two personal leave days annually, which is also consistent with the district's past superintendent contracts. Finally, the contract provides for reimbursement for mileage, professional dues up to $2,500 annually, and attendance at professional meetings and conferences. Is there a second, second to this second. motion? Second. Second. <laughs> Third. Second. Oh, I mean it. Second. <laughs> board input, board discussion. Are we prepared to vote? Might as well. You bet. Vote. Roll call, please. Member Carter. Yes. Member Exum. Yes. Member Patton. Yes. Member Pulaski. Yes. Member Fisher votes yes. Vice President Hall. Yes. President Demet. Yes. Motion is approved. basically has said it all wow I don't following that that was an amazing speech John thank you thank you all for coming out on a Sunday evening love you guys um, I'm just gonna say very short thank yous I would like to thank the board for this opportunity um, it has been a, a, a long couple of weeks I feel like I've gotten to know you all so well so quickly <laughs> Um, but I appreciate your uh, support and, 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 and again, your uh, great comments and, and lovely accolades in your um, speech, John. I appreciate that. I'd like to thank my immediate family. I'm here and in Chicago. Uh, Reverend and Sister Tatum are both ill, but they, they, they're here in spirit. My husband, Bryant, Jordan, and Bryson, both at Urbana High School. They're excited about me uh, being there. <laughs> Jordan, Jordan is afraid I'm going to be there like every day now. <laughs> we won't do that. Um, they have really been my backbone. Um, I just appreciate their patience and encouragement. The last few weeks have been hectic at our house, um, as well as the last two years. So they've just um, been there for me and um, just provided so much love and support and encouragement. I couldn't have done this without them. Um, I want to thank every student. Are there any students here besides my two? Jaden, Amari. Well, I want to thank every student staff member. I love you guys. Um, parents, yay, thank you for coming. Administrators, I see some administrators in the room. I can't have my back to you guys. Um, the community for your faith and support and my leadership, it means a lot that you guys believe I can do this work, that you guys believe in me and have faith in me and know that I can lead this great district. I'm so excited about that. Um, I'm honored to have been chosen through this national search process. And as John said, right here, under everybody's noses, right? But there were great candidates, and, and I think it speaks a lot to the district that we looked nationally, as well as um, that, you know, I'm here, invested, and in, I love Urbana. I look forward to getting started quickly, repairing relationships, as John mentioned. Um, strategic planning with input and collaboration from all of you and everyone else in the district. We are going to move onward and upward great and do great things together. I'm so excited. Thank you. So immediately upon close of this meeting, Jennifer and I will actually sign the documents up here and make it official. <laughs> but I would like to at this point in time to announce that um, the district intends to have a uh, meet and greet or meet and congratulate uh, uh, this Tuesday night, the 28th. Next Tuesday. I'm sorry, next Tuesday, the 28th, uh, from 4 to 6 p.m. in the UHS Commons. Uh, and so we encourage everyone in the community and all uh, employees of the district that uh, 
uh, would like to. Uh, we'll we'll try to make it as Lori will try to make it as great a, uh, an event as possible. So, with that, uh, we are at the end of our written agenda. Unless any board member wishes to give a board report, otherwise, I believe a motion to adjourn would be in order. So moved. Second. Second. All in favor, say aye. Aye. Those opposed, same sign. Before we say we adjourned, um, having been somebody that's uh, gone through a national search, it shows that we have real strength, uh, that um, our employee, soon to be employee, um, uh, comes to us uh, through all of the uh, benchmarks that uh, could possibly be tested against. Uh, and so we're looking forward to it. Amen. And I'm, I'm, I'm in the, it's Sunday, I'm sorry. <laughs> I guess we're adjourned. <laughs>